Welcome to this first video in a series where we will explore some common styles for delivering educational and training content and how to optimize their use. I'm Eric. I'll be leading you through our discussion on three delivery styles, having your learners read, listen, and practice. Our outcome for this video series is to explore the strengths and weaknesses of each style so that you can implement the most effective styles for your learning outcomes. Learners can learn by reading, listening, and practicing, among other styles. Various types of activities fall within each of these three styles as listed here. After a brief overview, we will discuss reading, listening, then practicing. As an overview, let's compare these different styles. Often, content is delivered using these three styles in this order. Do your readings, come to class, listen to the lecture, then complete some practice questions. This can be very effective, but the styles you use and their order should be geared toward your outcomes. So experiment with style and order, see how learners engage, ask for feedback, and measure retention. These styles are also on a spectrum. As we move down the spectrum, we are required to focus on more specific parts of the content. We lose breadth. But the trade-off is that learners are more likely to retain the content as we move down the spectrum. We gain depth. Let's talk about our first delivery style, where learners read. But first, you have a reading assignment. Read the extract on the next slide. Answer the two following questions as you read. Is there still room for reading as a style of learning, given that the availability of other media, such as online videos? Think of one of your workshops or lessons in which learners would benefit from reading. How would you implement effective readings? Pause the video here as you read. It would have been a challenge to lecture all of the information contained in the previous slide. This example illustrates how reading can make difficult content or a large volume of content more accessible to learners. High level study questions rather than factual ones guide learners through the readings and help them understand their relevance. You can even coach learners to read strategically, such as reading headings first and making marginal notes. If reading online articles, learners can use GIST Note, a Chrome extension to highlight text on any website. In our next video, we will cover how learners learn through listening.